All right, Escape Room, The Sorcerer's Curse. Let's check it out. Start game. How to play, WC to move around, press 1 for backpack, 2 for hints, H for help, press K to skip, all right. Use your mouse to look around, obviously. Click your mouse to interact with items, okay. I like these apples. We can, these clearly are covering up a piece of paper we should probably read, right? Let's get these out of the way. Get out of here. Be gone. All right, let's click this. Uh, game rules, have fun. We don't want any players to feel blue. Make sure you have read, missing an A, all the instructions. Once you open the door, there's no going back. Good luck. Got some typos there. Okay, what's this? Uh, tip, stuck on a tricky puzzle? Press 2 for hints. Hints are visible to everyone, but count against your score, so be conservative. Alright, this one. Tip, some objects can be collected. Press 1 to inspect them in your backpack. All backpack items are visible to everyone. They're at, like this? Okay, uh, tallest vase. This is the tallest vase. It's so tall. And I inspect it. Okay, is there like anything hidden inside of it? Nope, can't even see inside of it. Uh, we can zoom in. Oh, look at that butt! <laughs> look at the butt of that vase! Look at that butt! Alright, uh, gather. Uh, uh, picked up a tall vase. Okay. Hmm, it stays zoomed in, huh? If we go back to it, it's still zoomed in? No, it goes back to normal. Okay. Okay, so, got a tall vase, and that's what it looks like. Fancy. Moving on. What's this? Tip, interactable objects have a white outline when they are centered and close. Click to interact with them. Okay. Eh, like this, gotcha. Is your mouse moving too quickly or slowly? H to adjust your sensitivity. It seems all right. What's this? Keep calm and get puzzling. All right. Do I want to do anything with this flame? The flame? The flame. All right. Hmm. <laughs> More signs. The small is left of the tallest. Okay. Left where? I see uh, podium is over here. So I don't have the small one, I don't think, but I do have the tallest. If it's left of the tallest, that means the tallest one is somewhere on the on the right three. So we'll put you here for now. Now the small. So that's the tallest vase. I only see two vases, yeah. There's four spots on the podium. <gasps> there's two chests. I bet these have uh vases inside of them. Yes, I bet that's where the remaining two are. I must solve you. You have colors. What happens? So we have colors. I can spin the dial. How does so I, you click on it and it spins? How does one how do I make it kind of like, how do I lock in a color is the question. It's not telling me how to do that. Right click, space, E. Well, how, how do I... Alright, well, maybe there's a, a, like a guide for that or something. Uh, can I go through here yet? The door is locked. Okay. What about this one? Okay, just your typical uh, little number puzzle. How do I... Okay, you drag it up. Okay. That's the thing to work with. Any more hints? Aha! We recommend a pen and paper for some puzzles. One equals one one. Okay. Blank equals two ones, two one. Blank equals dot dot dot. I have no idea how I'm supposed to decipher that. That is, uh, it's a puzzle. It's a riddle. So, wait, is is the code just simply 1121? It can't be that simple, right? Impossible. It would be too easy if it were just 1121. Yeah, that's what I thought. Nothing happened. Okay. More hints, maybe. More hints. Give me the hints. Anything else I'm missing? The two extremes are not together. So... Probably the small... Okay, that would be like the, sh the smallest vase is not next to the tallest vase. Which means the tallest vase won't be there. So the tallest vase either goes here or here. Okay. Do you guys do anything, apples? Do you? What's this? Uh, neither two smallest are second. Neither of the two smallest or second. I'm guessing second from the left, which would mean this would be the tall vase. If it's, and then the smallest. Oh, did I not? Did I not click it? Use. There we go. So that would mean the smallest goes here, and the second smallest goes here, and that would be the solution to the puzzle. I've already got that one figured out, easy peasy. The question is, are there any more hints telling me how to get into these? Because I don't feel like I have enough information. And no, there's literally only one thing that gives me a hint towards like the number thing and no hints for the uh orange puzzle neither two are small or second. Oh wait 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 wait. Don't want any players to feel blue. Make sure to have read all the instructions. Once you open the door there's no going black. So it's blue, red, black. How did I not notice that? I just thought those just I thought they were typos. Blue, red, black. Okay, so uh blue. Okay. No, that's purple. Uh Blue. We oh, you just click it. Blue, red, black. Aha! 
So you just have to click on it and go straight to it. Okay. All right, let's go. Feels good. The middle sizes are in height order left. The middle sizes are... I think we already have this solved, right? Uh, small is fast. Goes on the left, right? Yeah, left, right, right, left. Okay. Put to you, my friend here. Do these things happen to have, like, hints for the numbers on them, maybe? No? All right. Use you there. There we go. So, this is the last one right here we have. Hmm. What could this mean? I, I have no idea. I'm going to use a hint. I'm going to use a hint. Uh, hints reveal hint. Have you found the number puzzle? Look for pen and paper. Yeah, yeah. I, I found the number puzzle for pen and paper. Yeah. Um, it's... I, I can't figure it out. Uh... Next hint. If 11 equals two ones, what could 21 equal? Okay, so that's what we're trying to figure out. So we're trying to figure out what this is. So if 11 equals two ones, what could 21 equal? Um, I don't know. Uh, so, so, so what does this mean? Like, is a one worth 5.5? Five .5? Or is a one just like, you know, the one goes to that digit, the one goes to that digit. So, you know, I, I, I don't understand it at all. I have honestly no idea. Real solution. 21 equals 1, 2, and 1, 1. Oh, ew, it's not like, it's it's like a play on words. Oh, enter 12, 11 in the number pile. Like, I never would have gotten that. Oh, it's a play on words. 1, 1. Wait, no, is it? The solution, it still doesn't make sense. Like, this makes sense. I don't understand... Uh, this right here, two ones, how is, and if it's, if it's a play on words, okay, oh, one, 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 that makes sense, but two ones, there, there isn't two ones over here, there's only one one, so how, how am I supposed to solve it when the puzzle itself seems wrong right here? I don't know, maybe missing something, but it's, uh, so it's one, two, one, one. Also, how did you get one two one one? Enter twelve eleven in the number padlock. One two one one. Oh, it just—it's just you put. It's, so you're putting this number in backwards. Why this number backwards? One two one one. Why am I putting in this backwards? One two one one. I don't understand why we're putting that in backwards. It doesn't make a lot of sense to me. But all right, I, I, even with the solution, it doesn't make sense to me. But well, here we are. Open the chest. All right. Even with the solution, makes no sense to me. Small vas. Small vas. Take a look at it here, okay? Even with the answer, it still doesn't make sense. And that should be right. Right? Okay. Door's locked. Okay, so what do we do wrong? Are you know what? I'm using a hint. Maybe it's just like a bad puzzle. Have you found all four parts of the riddle? Can you work out the order of the vases? Yes and no. The four vases need to go in the four pillars. Select a pillar. Yes, yes, yes. I know how to do that. If I told you the small vase is first the far left pillar. Okay. Well, that's one of the possibilities we figured out. So, that's one of the possibilities we tried. Still, didn't figure it out for us. Place the vase place the vases on the pillars from left to right. Small, largest, large. Wait, 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 wait. It wants largest and then large. But, 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 they said they had to be in order for... Did I read it wrong? They said it had to be in order! Where's that thing? The small is left to the tallest. The middle sizes are in height, order, left to right. Oh, I'm stupid. It says the middle sizes are in height order, not the middle pillars. Oh. Hence the problem. I thought it said the middle pillars are in height order. No, it's the middle sizes, meaning uh, small and large are in order. Okay, that's why I literally read the, the note wrong, and I wasn't really rereading it properly, hence why we couldn't get it right. There we go. Okay, well, I didn't solve it. They solved it for me, but read the notes very carefully. All right, that's the end of the demo. Cool. Um, oh, more... For the next challenge, Sorcerer awaits you. All right. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked that, please subscribe and check out some of my other videos.